Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the curtain is about to go up. The Hoppet Theater has been around since 1990, but it's always been a dream for Robert Brock. He hopes that this handy art will always appeal to generations young and old. I've always wanted the theater, and I always knew I would live above it. Mom! The ticket sales are terrible. And they said that I wasn't American Pie enough. Plus, I think it was a little too gay. <laughs> September and October is for grown-ups only. It can get a little raunchy. I just can't keep this pace up. I've never had a long-term relationship. His audience is that partner. It's the relationship that I've had the most success with. Thank, Thank you. you. You're a wonderful yes. audience. But luckily, I had the theater to escape. Thank you. When you're working as an actor, you have to audition, and it's constant rejection. I was having some depression issues, and my career wasn't going where I wanted it. It was the rejection I just had a hard time with. With the puppets in the puppet theater, I can play all the roles. I don't have to audition. I can have complete control. Oh, Tata, we're home. Children now, they're asked to grow up too soon. For 35 minutes, you can escape and go into a totally different world. We'll sing them all and we'll stay all night. He's just brilliant. He's funny, 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 funny all the time. <laughs> In a way, the puppets are his family. He made them, he created them. My priority is the theater in my life. The theater exposes them to make-believe, wonder. There isn't too many other places like this. Come on, everyone, second star to the right, straight on to morning. Are you ready now yeah. for me to say the magic words? On with the show.